In this video, we're going to compare a stupidly expensive RC car to a dirt cheap one. Guys, in this video, we're going to unbox and have a little look at this WL Toys highest um, financement. What that means is it's dirt cheap. So you can get this car from Banggood to this one tenth scale. So what that means is it's the same size as, I think, a Traxxas TRX4. All right, let's crack it open. Subscribe. So, in the box, you get car, battery, charger, instructions, radio. But you do need to supply your own AA batteries. So, size-wise, it is around about the same size as a TRX4. Now, this one here is modified. This is not how they come out of the factory. So, this is what the TRX4 looks like as it comes. And as you can see by the price, this one here is a tenth of the price. But... Is the TRX4 10 times better? In this review, we will see. Now this is definitely a toy grade. I don't think you can buy any parts for it as far as I'm aware. Once you break it, that's it, you're done. Um, it's got kind of toy grade steering. We're gonna see how that works once the batteries are installed and this battery is charged. Um, it has the motors actually inside the axles. Shock absorber wise, it does have quite a lot of axle movement, probably more than the TRX4, or at least about the same anyway. But there is no oil-filled chocks. These are just springs, so. But for the money, you know, you can't really expect that much. So we're gonna see in a little while how capable this thing really is. So to charge it up, you plug this into there and the other end into a USB. By the way, I've been a full-time YouTuber for a couple of years now. So if you're interested and maybe you wanna do the same, have a look on my website, the link down below, and I'll show you how much you can earn and what's involved. All right, battery's charged. It took round about a couple of hours. And the cover's secured by a couple of clips and a screw. That's what she said. All oh, right, let's give it a blast. That's what she said. Oh, guys. It's actually got proportional steering. <laughs> Look at that. I'm surprised. You can steer it a little bit or you can steer it a lot. I'm actually pretty surprised. All right, let's see what it can do. Oh, look at that suspension flex. Actually, guys, it's fully proportional. Look, you can go slow. All right, this is the slowest speed it can go. Pull the trigger more and it goes faster. All right, let's set up some obstacles. So we're gonna start off with an obstacle course and then we're gonna try a hill climb. Alright, so let's try the same again with a Traxxas TRX4. Now it is a little bit of an unfair advantage because this obviously is a lot more expensive and also it's been modified. We've got brushless motors and if you have a look underneath it's got heavier axles and brass portals to keep that centre of gravity down lower. So anyway, this is all I've really got to compare it to so let's go. So far, for the price, obviously, the expensive one did do a little bit better. All right, so next, let's try the hill climb. So we're gonna start off with a 45 degree incline. Let's see how it can do. 
Oh, straight up. Oh, let's make it a little bit steeper. Straight up, a little bit more. Oh, right, so that there is just about the limit. So we're looking at around about 53, 54 degrees. All right, let's try the TRX4. Yes, yeah, straight up, no messing about. I mean, it could probably go a little bit steeper, but it is on the it is on the limit. Look, it's lifting that front wheel. Let's see if we can do a little wheelie up the hill. Oh no, tumble wumble. All right, I've got one last obstacle. I've just stacked up the RC cars here. So let's see if the Traxxas TRX4 can make it over the top. And then we're gonna try the WL toys. Oh, he's struggling. Is it too much for it? Oh, and it's getting over. It's getting over. Check that out. Now we're coming up to the descent. Is it going to make it off the edge without falling over? Oh, and it makes it. All right, let's try the same again with the WL toys. Let's try again. Oh. It hasn't quite got the power of the TRX4, but it's still having a good go. Ah, oh, tumble wumble. Ah, oh, it was close. Maybe it could do it if I tried it a few more times. All right, so next I want to try a turning circle test. Alright, so here we go for the turning circle test. So full lock on the WL toys, let's go. Uh. Alright, so now let's try the Traxxas TRX4. Right, full steering lock. Alright, oh, so that's it for this video guys. You know, for the price it's fairly capable. I'm gonna put a link to this down below. So obviously, the TRX4 was the clear winner, but at 10 times the price, you know, it could be a good little toy for somebody that hasn't got the budget for one of these. So guys, hope you liked the video. If you did, give us a thumbs up, subscribe, smash the bell button, see you soon, bye.